This is a battle droid. Since 1999, LEGO has made 27 unique variants. Being 25 years old and with a growing demand from fans for a design change, it's only a matter of time before it's replaced with something new and the price skyrockets. So before that happens, I'm determined to get every single one and to make it a bit more interesting than just... Boy, I guess. And that's... That, that's it. That's the video. I'm traveling 1,181 miles to the world's largest LEGO convention to complete my Battle Droid collection. As if finding a needle in a haystack wasn't already going to be hard enough, I'll have the additional challenge of only having two days and $100 to do it. Not to artificially make it more difficult for the video, that's just all the time and money I have. Before that, let's set the scene. I like LEGO droids. There I said, so I know. So strong. How powerful. <laughs> oh, thank you. So brave. Thank you. But there are a lot of different droids. These things are super common. They're hard not to own, and you probably have some and might not have even noticed because they usually come bundled with far cooler minifigures, thus making them easily ignored. Like you are, by your parents, for still buying Lego. To prevent someone from proudly exclaiming that you stupidly missed such an obvious example, how could you? I'm only going after stock standard B1 droids. And only B1 minifigures. No supers, commandos, pilots, magna, tactical assassins, or any other brick built insert fool or accurate nerd name here. As a relatively early adopter and bad decision making, my battle droid army has been growing for over the last 17 years, with the most recent additions coming from the big battle pack in May 4th promo. Parting together a few more with extra pieces, I'm 70% the way there. To have a complete collection, I only need to get eight more, and I think some should be rather easy to get, while others, like the elusive sand red battle droid, will probably be much, much more difficult and much, 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 much more expensive. I should probably just order these online and save both time and money. Or I could go to Brick World Chicago, the world's largest Lego convention. It's a uh, lesser known fact is that it's also the world's largest BO convention. You don't have to pay extra for that part. For a Lego convention, this place seems a bit ostentatious. Hello. Using this checklist, I'll be able to track what I'm missing. I just hope they have them all. <laughs> for those that have never been to a LEGO convention, I have three ways to get what I'm looking for. I can purchase it from one of the dozens of vendors that set up shops, ask random people that are just visiting if they're willing to sell stuff on their display, or go to the yard sale and hope that someone is trying to get rid of what I need. Today I'll have the stores and if I can't find them all, then I'll start asking random people. If that fails, then hopefully tomorrow the yard sale will work out. To help keep track of everything, I printed out a cheat sheet with all the different prices to make sure I don't get completely screwed over. I'm probably gonna get completely screwed over. But I only have $100 to spend, and you might think that seems like way too much. Oh, how much are the Magna Guards? They're 65. 150? <laughs> oh my god. The $10,000 Cloud City. It's gonna be close. The shops are behind me. I've done my homework. Now I need to hope that this all goes well. First stop, Pop's Block Shop. If he has it, he's an awesome, great store that you should go to. If he doesn't have anything, never buy anything from him ever. I'm seeing his stink lack of battle droids. I throw them all in there. Oh, so, so I have to dig. Digging, okay, but okay. I don't think I have any of these in there. I'm sorry. Yeah, you should I'm, be. I'm a failure. You, I would, you are. <laughs> Jesus. First store's a bust. Saw some battle droids. I think there might, or I hope there might be something there. I have no idea. This is going poorly. Oh, there it is. Okay, we have one. One of the pilot droids. Excuse me? Do you have any more battle droids that aren't on the wall? Um, oh, that is one of them. That's two of them. This is going pretty well. On your bar one. Oh, yep. My cameraman Holly wants a Pirates of the Caribbean figure, so I'm gonna try to bundle my three and hers for 50. That's 50, Sam. Th no. <laughs> Good luck on the rest of them. I think, appreciate it, thanks. All right, Holly, you owe me money because I just burned through a lot of supplies. I'm already halfway through, and the amount of people that have been asking me what I'm doing has been quite fun, and a few people have even come back and said they found some here and there, so I'm gonna go look and find those. But thank you to everyone that's uh, going out of their way to try to find them at the stores instead of enjoying the convention on their own. I really appreciate it. There is one of them. He's eight bucks and it has the wrong head color. Is there a way I can swap the head out for a tan one? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's so worth it. One down. Now, let's follow the lead that I got earlier on that jetpack droid. Oh, there it is. Found one. Excuse me? Can I get this one from you? Thank you. Very good. A few more shops to hit, but it's not looking likely. I only have $57 left, and I don't even know if that'd be enough for the single droid, let alone the two I need. I'm, we're struggling here. Do you have any questions? I do have one. Do you have either one of these battle droids? Or do you have any lower in battle droids than the ones up there? Let's just look here. That's it? That's all the Star Wars? These walls scare me. $25 for a mixel. Do we have any sand red battle droids, honey? Good luck. 
Yeah, no. I don't have that printed one. No. Yeah. I do not have any battle uh, That's pretty much it. Not complete. Okay. That was a bust. For a hundred dollars. Ooh. Not, maybe not today. Okay. Next. I am concerned. I know I've already said it, but we only have a few more vendors, and if they don't have it, that means I have to start asking people that don't sell stuff, which means talking to people that don't, oh, God. You wouldn't happen to have one of these two particular battle droids, would you? Sand red and then a security droid with no the- sand red. Do you have any in the back, do you know? Oh, what'd you find? The ones I found, are these any of the ones you need or not? One of them is, yes. Yeah? Yeah, how much do you want for it? I sell them for eight bucks a piece. Eight bucks? Okay, I think I might have accidentally got the wrong figure. I'm not sure. There's a different security battle droid from 2002, and I think that's that one. I need to, I need to, figure that out. I think it's the same droid. I think they re-released it later on in 2014 just with a straight arm instead of a curved arm. I'm pretty sure it's right and if that's the case all I need to do is swap out the arm and I'm good to go. Sam's helping out. Sam, thank Do you want a curved arm for it? Yeah, I'll try. Thank you. One step closer. <clears throat> this is an interesting experience. I'm going around recording all this hunting amongst these hundreds and hundreds of spectacular mocks, and it's not awkward at all with well, people watching me currently doing this. Right now, Pop's Block Shop, the one right down back there, he's, uh, he's he shared on his Instagram to, to rally the troops to find one. Apparently his war call came through and people brought him battle droids, so I'm gonna go see what he has. Hopefully, sand red. Let's, uh, let's see what you ended up with. We got some droids in the house from our uh, challenge. I did end up getting these ones, though. Do you want me to buy them anyway since you went through the trouble? Are you sure? Are you sure? Okay, thank you, I appreciate it. I hit every store in the convention and came up short. Time for step two, asking random people if they have my last droid for sale. Do you have any sand red battle droids? I do not, unfortunately. I know if I endorse this, and I don't know if this is actually anything good or if it's just gonna be a stupid joke that I'm gonna cut out, but Ryan said follow him. He might be able to help with the most expensive droid. Do you have a sand red battle droid? He's looking for sand red I battle don't. droids. I You've wasted my time. Problem. The hunt continues. Do you have any sand right? No. I found a potential backup. Someone has them on the display. They might be willing to sell one. They have four of them. They might not. It's a backup, but he has to think about it. For now, the hunt continues. Do you have any sand red battle droids? I sadly do not. No. Do you have a sand red battle droid? Sand red. Battle Specifically droid. for sale. Specifically I, I not. not. There's okay. one on a build over there you could probably steal. Thank you. <laughs> Where are we going? Oh, Whoops. I'm leading. Right. Yeah. Onward. Okay, what? This could get on my way. It's that guy. Blue guy. Okay, this was a waste of time. I thought this was gonna be the easiest to find, the most expensive one, but I've not found it. Still have the yeah, fail. I probably asked 40 or 50 people today, but only one person both had one and considered parting with it, but they seemed really, really disinterested. So my backup plan was a complete failure. It went down hard. My audio didn't record here. Basically what I said was, there's a reason why this one single droid has eluded me the whole time. We have a lot of parts. Um, these are all parts. Yet out of all of these parts, this is all the sand red that we have. It's easy to understand why. Despite there being 85,000 unique Lego pieces and nearly 17,000 different minifigures, sand red being cut out of the production line after only four years resulted in a meager 39 individual elements, five of which belong to this battle droid. It's no surprise at all why this one is sold for upwards of $50. Now my hope is, despite the production run of these being non-existent, that Hopefully, because it's a much more rare and coveted figure, it'll be easy to find. That, that's my hope, at least. Well, I could not have been more wrong. Fortunately, I still have my backup backup plan, the yard sale. And it's exactly what it sounds like. A bunch of people trying to sell whatever Lego that they don't want or don't need to other people for somewhat almost decent prices. I was hoping that I was gonna be able to find it through one of the vendors because the yard sale, it's, it's, it's a disaster. There are too many people in a room that's too small with prices that are too expensive. It's gonna, it's a, it's a mess. This year they're trying to make it a little bit better by giving us time slots. And fortunately, I was lucky enough to get an eight o'clock time slot, which is the earliest one possible. The hunt begins. This place is a nut house. There are hundreds of people in here and this room is not big enough for it. They let us in about ah, 12 minutes ago and I've gone to almost every shop here and I have not found one yet. Me recording this for the video is wasting more time. I'm pretty concerned I'm not gonna find any and this is my last shot. No, you don't. You're... Did you already sell it? Did you actually and you didn't tell me? No, it's here. Where? Are you messing with me? No. Is this yours? Yeah. Do you have San, uh, San Red Battle Droid? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How much do you have on it? 22. Thank you, sir, for helping. I'm not paying for this. 
Got it. I'm gonna be. I'm super awkward amongst all these people. There's a ton, a ton of people in here. I'm gonna try to head out uh, because there's too many. But I got it. Last possible chance. Last possible person. I got it. And that's all of them. And I am pretty excited to have them all. I wish I would have done a better d display for the video of showing them all done, collected, and together. But that's all of them. And boy, howdy, is that <laughs> kind of underwhelming. And <laughs> it's not quite as underwhelming what I'm about to tell you. And that is that there's um, a handful of variations on torsos, which means I missed out on potentially dozens and dozens of droids that aren't here right now. But it is a little bit more underwhelming than the end of this video which is just this music's i hope it's copyright free <laughs>